um, I think with our last interview, Debbie, you already anticipated <laughs> <laughs> one question that I have for you. And that is, what was it like um, for the two of you to work uh, with your spouse in the office? Do you want to go first? I'll go first. Um, actually, what was it like? But uh, you should, should also ask, uh, is it a problem? I would say definitely not a problem. Because during the day, uh, we had so many uh, things to look after, business things to look after, interviews, clients, and so on, that we never really had much uh, time to go out and get into any personal dissertations or discussions. So that uh, between nine t between 8.30 and 12.30, we hardly, you know, we saw each other, but only fleetingly. Uh, and then, of course, at 12.30, we... Most of the time we went back, um, I took Debbie to the university or we went home for lunch. So I think it was uh, it was a piece of cake. There was absolutely, no one would even know that we were married. Very few people even knew Debbie's name because we never had business cards that we passed out. At least Debbie never did. I had business cards with my name on it. But I would say less than 10 people of all these years knew that we were married uh, because she just went by Debbie sort of thing. Maybe stop it. Business. Give him to John. Okay, whatever. Okay. Okay. Is that so all you have that's, to say? That's pretty well all oh, I have to okay. say. Okay, well, I have a lot more to say. Um, I'd say there are both negative and positive points uh, being a, a married couple working together. I always remember Mrs. Gummelt warning, saying it's never a good idea for a married couple to work together. You know, you'll see and blah, blah, and especially in the foreign office, it, you know, she said that they really discouraged people <laughs> being together. Um, and I mean, there were couples in, even in the consulate that worked At together. the embassy in Ottawa. And the embassy? The people that went up yeah, to Churchill? But probably not in the same, yes, but probably not in the same office. One was... Politi uh, politische Abteilung, uh, the, andere war, uh, the, the other one was in the uh, press uh, department. Yeah. I forget and their names. As far as the negative aspects go, um, both of us tend to be people that have fairly strong opinions about things. When I think I'm right, I think I'm right, and I'm very stubborn. And Jerry tends to be that way too. I agree. So many times there would be differences over, um, you know, what we believed was the right thing to do. However, we did manage to solve those problems. But I think under ordinary circumstances where you're not related to your boss, um, that you would take a much more respectful attitude. And many times I was <laughs> not. I have a lot too much to say. And... Um, you know, because I have worked in the field for so long and there were times when I did know more and times when I didn't. So, you know, I, I, in the end, I suppose that evened out. That, that's the negative part. The positive part is in that kind of work, you really can't talk to very many people about it. For one thing, it's the confidential nature. And for another thing, most people just aren't really interested. They have no interest in that kind of thing or they don't understand it enough to know. So a lot of times we'd have you know great discussions over lunch or supper together and at least we could be very open and discuss things totally together, which is, is very nice. So that was a positive um, aspect. But... Um, but overall, especially in the early years, um, Jerry really wasn't at the office most of the time. He came in to sign, so there really weren't issues at that time. Um, but I think the more we, we worked together, then the more those things... Only the last four years. Yeah, but the more those things came to light, that, you know, we had differences of opinion. Three years, three years. Otherwise, when Jerry wasn't around, I could just go ahead and do what I thought was right anyway. <laughs> and he usually forgot, so it was okay. Thanks. Yeah. But I did sign your stuff without changing your documents. To yeah, me. most of the time. You, yeah, you didn't like my editorial comments most of the time either. Correct. But you have to remember that's my job yes. at the university. So, so yeah, so that, that's, that pretty well sums that up, I guess. Not much negative stuff. That I was great because I had a ride to work every day. <laughs> I know why to the to your second job. <laughs> well, no, I often took the bus. Well, mm -hmm. except for the last three, four years. Mm -hmm. well. well, then I was visiting my mom, though. So yeah, yeah, yeah. right. Yeah, so that's yeah. about it.
That's about the answer. You're right.